Okay, guys, back again with another Blue Bonnet review. Um, this book you're going to see on your screen is called Lexi McGall and the Teleportation Tournament. And we don't have this book in our library anymore because one of our copies um, got ruined and one of our copies never got turned back in. So hopefully we can get another copy of this book because this was probably my favorite blue bonnet this year and you might be like miss sportsman what um i didn't expect this to be my favorite blue bonnet but i really liked the action in this book um and i know i talked before about words on fire and i really liked that book too but in this book lexi lexi um she is um having to change schools and um, this is kind of set in the future because they have teleportation devices and we don't have those yet. And so she's moving from a school that was kind of like a, like a prep school, like a, a school that has all kinds of monies to buy everything to a public school. Like what we go to, we go to a public school and we don't always have everything. And so she, there's this tournament that she's always been in. Um, with her group of friends from her old school, and they've always had all the stuff that they need to do it. And so she still wants to be in this tournament, but she's a little bummed because she has to rent a teleportation device because her new school doesn't have one. And so she talks a couple of people into being on the team with her because she can't be on a team by herself. Um, and they end up being really good friends, but they start out a little rocky. And so this book is really cool because it's kind of like a mix between um, the show Amazing Race, if you've never seen it. I don't know if you guys have ever seen it, but it's kind of like a scavenger hunt where you get a clue and you have to read the clue and figure out what it means. And it takes you to the next place to get your next clue. And only in this book, they have teleportation devices built in. So the clue that they might have will lead them to a different place, a different country. Um, and But you have to figure out all the clues in order to get you there. And the first team to get to the last clue um, and cross the finish line wins a, a big, huge prize. And so I won't tell you who wins. I won't tell you exactly what happens. But I will tell you that this book, um, following Lexi and her, um, her team, who are kind of the underdogs, throughout this tournament was just so uh, exciting. And I really, really like this book. This was probably my favorite blue bonnet this year. So hopefully we can get another copy of this and you guys can check it out. See you later, guys.